one thing about me. I keep it low key, and everything I say is right, dope. Air magazine, super exclusive. I'm out here with the Bay Boy boss himself. Hey, Seuss, man. Yes, sir. What's going on, world? Shout out Dope Era Magazine. It's the kid, International Hey, Seuss, a.k.a. Mr. Three Steps, out here. Yeah, so he just dropped off his body of work to the Dope Era offices. And, uh, you know, we will be doing a review on that album sure. later on this evening. Uh, so tell us more about yourself, man. Well, you know, 23 years old, coming straight out of East Oakland, California, born and raised. Um, most people may not know me because for the past five years, I was actually at Howard University in D.C. So, you know, I spent my time out there just really just trying to push the whole education thing. So I'm out here back now, just graduated and ready, you know, ready to make an impact in the game. Yeah, so you just put out that work, man. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So are you uh, working on any other projects that, you know, we should be on the lookout for? Yeah, next, well, you got, you got the EP. Next is the album, um, Forever Oakland. We'll be dropping probably this summer. And I'm, I'm working with strictly all Oakland artists, Oakland producers, Oakland videographers, everything Oakland, and just trying to, you know, bring it back to the town. And so that's what I'm working on next. So what made you want to hop in this game, my brother? Uh, man, like, uh, you know, for those that don't know, Molly is actually my blood cousin. G Molly's my blood cousin. And um, so just growing up, me and him, I should see my uncle, you know, G-Nut, Spice One, and just seeing them do it. it. It's just something that's always stuck with me when I was little. When, you know, when I got older, it was just always something that stuck around. And now that I'm older and really able to, you know, express myself, I feel like music is the best way for me to really push that message forward. And so that's why I kind of stuck with it. So what, what what would this body of work entail of? Would it be tales of uh, you growing up in Oakland? Would it be um, titles of the things that you've seen outside of Oakland? Yeah. Or will it deal with, uh, let's say, losing the childhood friend, things of that nature? Man, I think it would just be, you know, uh, embody all, all of those things, but really just Oakland in general from the time I grew up, from my upbringing to even now, it's like, People don't, a lot of people don't know that about me. Like, you know, I really come from Oakland. And, you know, when people say that, that it, it comes with something, like, negative. You see, I've seen the violence. I've seen the drugs. I've seen all of that. It's just now I didn't always choose to talk about it because I always felt like it was more to life than just, just the hood. And so now that I'm, you know, past that and kind of, you know, making my transition from the hood, I want to, you know, share that story of how I grew up and just how I am, how I became the man I am today. And that's for Oakland. All right, so... Um you just put out that nice fire single, yeah. Which is, by the way, on DopeAirMagazine.com. Out now. Um, tell us, tell us about that. Uh, you talking about in my city? Just dropped the video for that. Um, it'll be on iTunes in about a week or so. But basically, how that came about? That song actually, I think we recorded that about a year ago. And at the time, we just, me and Molly was in the studio just vibing out, just trying to you know work on a new sound, like what would be different. And we kind of like thought about the in my city. I think Molly came up with the hook, and I just you know said it, but. As the verses, as you hear, it's all about detailing, you know, what life was like for us growing up and just being growing up in our city, how, you know, it's negativity, how it's haters, but you still got to push through that. And I think that that's something that needs to be said. That's a message that needs to be broadcasted more. A lot of people want to talk about the negative stuff, but they don't see how the negative stuff can turn into positive. If you, if you look at it, it's all about your outlook on stuff. And so that's what I wanted to do with the song and the visual as well. All right, so, um... What would be the next uh, thing that you would be dropping, like far as a single, um, video? Yeah. Um, let the people at home know. So the next, like I coming next, will be visuals from the Three Steps Ahead EP, which dropped about a month and a half ago. I just been letting that marinate, selling the hard copies. So next, moving forward, I'm just working on all visuals from the EP. So you'll you'll be seeing that top of February, um, and just keep pushing that, keep promoting that. Okay. So. Uh, you know about the website. Can you let the fans outside, you know, know about what the website is? Yeah, for sure. Hey, Seuss, 510, H-A-Y-S-U-S, 510.com. Um, all things Hey, Seuss related, videos, pictures, whatever you need. It's a one-stop shop. So, you know, log on, tap in, and show love. And where can the people get that get that uh, EP at? Um, is it at Rasputin? Is it at Dimples? Uh, or is it just on you? Yeah, it's right now. It's strictly, well, not strictly. It's digital and hard copy. So, if you want digital, you can go to iTunes.com slash international I E N T H no I E N T L Jesus. You can get that on iTunes. Um, if you want hard copies, you in the Bay Area, I will pull up on you wherever. You feel me? Had to pull up on the you know the bro. I'm pulling up anywhere. If you outside the Bay Area, I can ship it. We know all type of ways. Any type of way you want to get it, it can it can it can get, be brought to you. So just tap in. Let me know. Either way. 
All right, so what advice would you give to somebody out there that's at home, that's trying to get on, that's watching your power moves? Man, I would just honestly, two things. One, stay patient. Two, have faith. Like, I think me personally, a lot of times I get kind of like complacent, like, damn, you know, I'm ready for myself to blow. I'm ready for the team to blow. But it's like, no, nah, God got you here for a position, for a reason. And it's, it's just for you to, you know, remain patient, stay humble, and keep working. I think if you do those things, you'll be successful. If you look in history, it's nobody that kept going, no matter how long it took, five, 10 years, 20 years, that kept going and wasn't successful. So I feel like as long as you keep grinding each and every day, you putting your best foot forward and really trying to you know, make stuff happen, it's gonna pay off for you. So just keep, like I said, be patient, stay, I mean, have faith, and you'll be straight. And that's really it. So um, do you have anything um for the people at home watching this right now? Yeah, man, I just want to say shout out to everybody that's watching this. Shout out to Dope Era Magazine um, for putting this together. Shout out to East Oakland, my city, man. I really feel like 2016 is the year for everybody to blow. So with that being said, if you're watching this and you're an artist, producer, whatever you're doing, just know your time is coming. Let's go. The reason why on every we on earth today, you, me, him, her, all these different uh, walks of life, it's all a test. It's like it's almost like an experiment, God's experiment. When are we gonna understand that we are put on earth to love? If it ain't about a 10, about a 20, about a 50, about a hundred, hell no, nah, they ain't talking about me. They ain't talking about me, nigga. Going crazy with the shine on my mind, fuck it, I'm a OD, and I'm feeling like they don't make them like this anymore at all. Ain't nobody making hits anymore at all. Yeah, I've been through yeah. the ups and the downs, I see that they fuck with us now. <laughs> Trying to understand the perfect meaning of real love, got down on my knees to pray and ask the man above. Core it every day, cause the hood. Be quick to judge Gave my nigga 50 And he four years after dub Free my nigga Mel Free dime Free little tone Trapped in the system It be hard to stay home Hustle in the morning Till them street lights come on The nigga that's the vibe Is the one that stay strong Molly and international Making decisions rational True society conglomerate Making our dreams actual